The purpose of this video is to demonstrate how a typical OEC scenario would be evaluated at the Eastern Division Young Adult Patroller Seminar. This is similar to a normal evaluation for an OEC practical or senior test, except that each component performed is worth one point for a total of 45 points for a competitor to score. This is a sample score sheet similar to one used at the Eastern Division Young Adult Patroller Seminar. Southern Vermont Region Young Adult Patrol Program Advisor and Trainer Evaluator Roger Del Giorno will now do a sample scenario where young adult patrollers will use this score sheet at the end to provide feedback. Follow along and enjoy. Um, you're being dispatched to a most difficult slope. You know that you've got to steer down. Uh, all equipment, whatever you need upon your request, will be sent. Okay. Okay. And as always, there'll be a slight delay before you arrest the arrive. Okay. 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 Hey there, you all right? Are you okay? Hey, my name is Roger with the Ski Patrol. Can I help you? Yeah, please. Okay, what's your name? Colleen. Colleen, you hurt your leg? Yeah. Okay. My left leg is killing me. Can I you, sir? Yeah, she knows. What I want to do is I want to mark the trail up here, but there's really no way for me to keep my feet here. I'm going to have you just kind of stand here so that nobody kind of comes behind us. You bet. Okay? It hurts. It feels weird. It hurts my feet. So where does it hurt again? On my leg. On your leg. as of a fall? Yeah, I was going down and I should have never been on the fall. I knew I shouldn't have been, but my friend insisted I try it and I got too, too much speed and I kind of went forward on my skis and they didn't release and oh, okay. it just hurt like crazy. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, so God. Colleen, on your leg there, what am I trying to do? Oh, God, it hurts. Have you ever heard this leg before? No. No, I've never had any problems. That's why it just feels so, it hurts so much and it feels so weird. Okay. Oh. Have you skied at Bromley before? Yeah, I have. Oh, good. Lots of Always nice to have people coming back to us. Okay. So, just focus on your leg here. Anywhere else beside your leg? No. Just okay. Anything inside your pants feel wet or sticky? Yeah, I think so, yeah. I didn't realize it. But this leg right. here? Uh, yeah, just down for it. I was going to be out of here. Oh. Does this hurt to move? Uh, no, it, just don't touch it. Okay. You don't mind. Just don't touch it. Oh. Oh, God. You said you feel something kind of wet. Yeah. Are these open? Uh, no, but down there it does. Okay. Oh. oh, man. Oh, it kills me. You think it could be broken? Oh. Boot warmers, always a good idea. Go under the okay, oh, all right. You see moderate bleeding. Okay. Oh, man, it's killing me. It's bleeding. Oh, God. Oh, God. That was not a cut that was there before, was it? No, it was fine. I never, oh. Do you feel nauseous or anything? No, no but did I, you hit I, your, did, I, did you hit your head or lose consciousness at all? No, not at all. Oh, how bad is the bleeding? Well, let's take a look. Oh, God. Am I gonna, am I gonna lose my leg? Lose your leg? Oh, what do you think it could be? Oh, God, it hurts. Okay. Oh. Oh. Looks like you have a little cut here. How bad is the cut? Can't see, but let's see if we can control <coughs> the bleeding. That should feel better. Yeah. And it is controlling with direct pressure. Okay. Oh. So, is the bleeding, is it keep bleeding? It doesn't look like it stopped. It looks like it stopped. Oh, oh man. Oh. Are you a doctor? I am not a doctor, what are you? but I'm on the patrol here. Oh. I'm supposed to be qualified to treat the injuries that people have here. Oh. What qualifications do you have here? Well, have you ever take a ride in the ambulance before? Yeah, yeah. I'm like one of those guys. Oh, okay. One of my friends, I had to drive in the ambulance with them. Okay. Oh, boy, it hurts. It feels so weird. Right down there, it's killing me. I, don't, I really don't want you to touch that part. Bleeding is controlled. <laughs> Patrol 58, the ski patrol. Go ahead. I'm on skier's right side of the Lord's Prayer. I'm going to need a bag, a sled, a quick splint, and two more patrollers. 10 4. Okay. You said you don't feel noxious or anything, no, right? I'm 
Let me grab. Good. Give me a thumbs up. Okay, relax. Okay. Got a pulse, which is good. Let's start. So, Colleen, where are you from? Long Island. Are you skiing with anybody? Yeah, I'm skiing with my friend. I thought she was my friend, so she made me come to this trail. It was her fault, huh? Good. Yeah, I told her I'm not that good. Okay, hold on. What I'm not going to be able to do is take off your boot here. Yeah, okay. So, but what I'm going to do is I'm going to splint it up so it doesn't feel so, as you say, weird. Okay. Okay. Oh. So, here we go. All right. So let me see that hand again. Oh. Give me a thumbs up, please. Okay. Relax. How long have you been here? I've just been here for three days. My third day, we're going home tonight. Let me rephrase my question. Have you been in this, how long have you been in this one spot? Oh, here? Um, probably about 15 minutes, maybe. It seems like forever, but I think that's really about it. I got a pulse of 62 and a respiration of 22. Can you, can you give me a Respiration is 22, pulse is 84. 84, respiration is 22. What did you ask for? Do you have any, anything for pain or aspirin? Not up here. Pain? We'll see once we get down below. Okay. Okay. So, Colleen, this is your first time really getting introduced. Can you sit up and go to yeah, the spot? No, All right. Okay. Let me take off your goggles. We can kind of look at each other. Okay. There you are. Hey, boy. How are you doing? <laughs> Okay. Did you hit your head? No, not at all. Just kind of lean forward. Excellent. Alright, what I want to do is I want to keep you warm so this is going to go right back in. Alright, thank you. What do you need? So I'm going to need a quick split and just uh, prep the sled with two blankets. We got a uh, left leg. Yep. So we got a we got a left leg, okay, okay, possibly an, an ankle as well. You had bleeding here, so everybody's gloves on. Okay. I'm gonna quick split here. I still gotta finish my secondary assessment. Okay. Okay. So, uh, any allergies? No. On any medications? Yeah, I take Zantac for ulcers. For ulcers? Yeah. Okay. So that's nothing I need to worry about no, right I, now. I took my medication. I'm quite okay. schedule with that. So it's uh. I want my phone to slide away. Okay, did you have breakfast today? Yes, I did. Hold, hold on one second. Okay. Anything hurt here? Nope, not at all. Okay. Are you come down here? Nope. Alright, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to feel if everything is equal. It is. Okay, so now I want to kind of come down this way. Any pain through here? Nope, not at all. Okay. Just the leg. Just get the bag out and sled ready to go. that I don't believe you. We just want to make sure okay. that we're not forgetting anything. Okay. Good idea. So, anything hurt in here? No. Anything throughout here? Nope. Take a deep breath for me. Any pain there? No. Does it come down through your ribs? Any nope. Pain? Nope. Nothing. Any pain here? Nope. Pushing it out. Pushing it out again. A little lower. Any pain? Nope. And out through here. Pain through here? Nope. Through your hips? Nope. Yeah. Oh, I just don't, I guess I want to twist that Okay. Leg. Scared me for a minute. I thought yeah, you no, it's something. just my leg went moved. Okay. Yeah, feel? Yeah, I feel it. Yeah, you're yourself there. So good. So, yep. So, all we got is the, uh, is the leg there. So, I'm going to give it a support. Yep. We'll put it into the quick split. There's a leg and an ankle. Leg and an ankle looks okay. right. Is that bleeding? Yeah, bleeding is not. Is all controlled? Yes, sir. Okay. I don't want to move. I really don't want to move so, the leg. Okay. We're going to try to re-angle this once. We got good CMS. I want you to be getting this into a spot. You tell me, Colleen. Okay. Colleen, this is sore and he's helping me hey, out. Hey, sore. How are you doing on it? Uh. Okay, put it as high as you can on it. Okay. Oh, so you can get higher. Okay. I'm going to try and straighten it. You tell me if it's okay. Uh, no more, no Not more. There? No okay. more. Okay. I'm going to hold right there for a second. Any padding in that bag?
What, do you, what are we going to do when you, you said you are taking me to first aid? Hey, have you ever gone to one of our sleds before? No, I haven't. Oh, lucky you. So what we're going to do is we're going to put you in the sled and we're going to take you down to the bottom of the mountain to the first aid. Uh-huh. And once we get there, we're going to take a better look at what we got here. Okay. And then you said, were you with somebody today? Yeah, but I, I don't know All if right, I All right, so we'll try to contact you from down below. Okay. His name is Bob. He just, I think he just left. So Bob's the person that we're mad at. Yeah. He wasn't right. much of a help. <laughs> You know how they can be. Oh. Is that something new, Bob? <laughs> <No>. <laughs> uh, boy, oh boy. He's going to owe me a good dinner for this. He took me on this stupid trail. I should have never been on here. Well, let me swap with you. Okay. Are you a doctor? No, I'm not. Well, what are you? Ski patrol and also in the Yeah, city. good qualifications for ski patrolling? Yes, I do. Are you sure? Mm -hmm. okay, I'm going to here. I'm going to do the other one. Go ahead. There you go. <laughs> How are we doing, Colleen? Uh, it hurts. Do you feel feet. nauseous or anything? No, it just hurts. You're tired? Nope, not okay. tired. Just hurts. Maybe you're just tight with that. Can we just go through it once? Yeah. Here we go. We got a lot. Here we go. Here we go. You grab the leg again for me? Sure. Who's, who's going to drive that uh, sled there? Uh, Do they know what they're doing? Yeah. Sure. I'm going to pass this underneath you. Now, if you could just tie those two together right there. It should keep coming. Nope, it's not a bow. I don't have the other side. I don't have the other side here. Follow the curve. Here we go. You think it could be broken? You know, I don't know. So, I want to get a better look at what we have right here on the leg, and then we'll take the boot off. We'll see on, on the inside. Okay. All right, so. Get down to the below. Okay. Okay. Can you feel that right there? Yep. Can you wiggle your toes? Yeah. What I want to do is I want to take a second set of vitals. You can take that glove off again. Nothing changed as far as the pain level, right? No, it's the same pain the whole time. It hurts big time. Do you think they'll have some, some medication or something that'll take away pain when I get down there? Um, I wonder if we can get to the hospital. You don't have to go to the hospital? We got a pulse of 62, respirations 22. Uh, pulse is 72, respirations are 20. Moving in the right direction, Miss Soren. All right, so now we're going to put you into the sled. You said you'd never taken a sleigh ride with us before. No. You will enjoy this. Are you sure? Yeah, I am sure. Who's going to be driving it? So, this is kind of weird, but as you know, my name is Roger. Yeah. That guy over there, his name is Roger too. He's Roger too. Hi, Roger too. <laughs> He will be our driver this evening. Oh God, really? Yep. You're kind of old. Is it the vlog? No, no, I just learned how to do it. Oh, I don't know. I like the young one. Okay. So, Colleen, I'm going to have you help me as much as you can. Sure. I'm going to have you scooch down. I'm going to put your feet in that side of the sled over there. Okay. I'm going to come around. I'm going to move it. Yep. I'm going to carry as much as you can. Roger's good. Ready? So, four G store on count three. Two, three. One, two, three. Keep going. Okay, keep going. One, two, three. Are you in position? Give me an assist. Oh, nice job for doing all that work, Holly. I appreciate it. Can you slide down for the end just a little bit? Okay, can you actually sit up for just a sec? Can you lay back? Okay, blanket on top. 
Okay. So, Colin, what I'm going to do, I'm going to put your goggles back down. Okay. You kick up a little bit of snow when we do this. Okay. Okay. Thank you. Strap in. Strap over to you. You're going to take this to the bottom? I'm going to slide it out. Is that good? It's slide? Not easy. Nope. Good? Good. All right. We're good. They want to pull you, through, not pull you through, but they want to make sure that they didn't cheat you out at anything, that you have like a good advocate for everything that you did, in this case everything that I did. Once all the, the uh, judges are done talking to each other, then the candidate comes in and I get feedback. I don't necessarily get the score, but I get feedback. Okay? So, how did I do? Anybody? Taylor? Um, I think you did good. I just, I don't know if I heard it or not, but I didn't hear feedback. Can you see? I didn't hear it either. So, I think I did say it when it came in, so what I did is I took the uh, bystander and I brought him uphill and I asked him to stand up here. Huh? Yeah? Okay. Yep. Yep. So what I could have said, going around here as I look up, I'm not underneath any kind of trees, but that's a good point. That's something that I could have said, again, in my mind that I did it, but because I didn't say it, a judge didn't pick up on it. It's a really good point. Caitlin, what about you? Or do you have more, Taylor? Um, no. I thought you had a whole list for me. No. <laughs> All right, Caitlin? Um, She has to look to find something. <laughs> That's a good thing. Because he didn't really tell. I don't know if I just didn't hear it, but he didn't really. When other patrollers came in, you didn't really tell them what was going on. Okay. I don't know if I didn't hear it or not. Okay. So what I did when Soren came in, I told him that we did have a, a, a blood and a possible ankle. But what I needed to do is I needed to complete the secondary survey first at that time. So I may have just been too quiet about that point. That's a good point. So it's very important to have the communication with the helpers that come in, so that there is a clear plan of action, but I could have said that louder. Good job. Uh, I don't think you have a finished sample. Mm -hmm. So, mm -hmm. you need to sample? So I definitely did signs and symptoms, which I had. I asked her about her allergies. And again, I was kind of face to face. We asked about medications. We asked about last meal and events leading up to the thing. So what do you think I missed? Past medical history. Past medical history. So I asked her, well, that was one of the first things that I said to her. So when I do sample, this is how my style is. I don't have it be an interview with the person. It kind of happens organically throughout. So one of the first questions that I asked her was, where's the hurt and did you ever hurt this leg before? Okay, so, but that, that, that's a good point. See, and like I said, I'm not a mnemonic person, so I kind of go a, as we go through it. But that's a good point. Um, I didn't really see him on the clip there anymore. I like you, he's my favorite so far. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I mean, well, I, well, not we, as good as my favorite, but all right. <laughs> <laughs> what we, we usually do is we do the secondary assessment as to what's coming. Okay. And this leg was already here and you're still doing a secondary assessment. Yep. So maybe like kind of like a rapid secondary assessment and they're bleeding. So maybe like yeah. Rapid so I, so, so I, had, I had to do blood, okay, which I took care of it. And they told me that it uh, was controlled uh, pretty much as, as soon as I did it. My help arrived pretty quick. All right, but I wanted to make sure that I did do the secondary assessment, so, so I, I did want to finish it. So my timeline could have been a little bit quicker, but the way that you describe it is the same way that I would do it, though. All right. Yeah. I don't really have anything. That's what I said. Sorry. Sorry. So, so, so what I'm hoping for, okay, is definitely I want to pass, which is, it sounds like that's something that I did. And if I can keep up that kind of energy throughout and do that every single time, you know, that'd be that'd be a great day for me. Okay. Nice job. Cool.